So this is the 250 pound boulder that we pulled down last year. I've had it soaking in 27 gallons of muriatic acid, which I drained off by hand this morning. And um, I'm gonna have my lovely wife hold the camera while I go through and pull these loose plates that you see down in here. Oh, look at this one and this one. Yeah, we need to dive into there. There's a big old fluorite vein over in that one. Um, we still got quite a bit of the boulder remaining. Um, I'll have to uh, pull this out, rinse it off, and let's see what's left of it. But uh, quite a bit did come off, so let's go ahead and see what came off of here. Safety first. Both. Beautiful. Yeah, I know. Look at that one right there. Okay, that's about to be real. Whoa! Wow. Yeah, wow, wow. Yeah, I need more room just to see what's down here. <laughs> Use a little more cleaning, but look at this thing. Oh my, wait, there's two. Holy smokes! Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Look at how red that is. But wait, there's more. Oh my goodness. I think it could still last this. More plates. That's cool. I think it's more plate. Cluster. Oh, look at the size of that point. Nice. like close to 100 pounds right there already. This thing should be much lighter. There's still more underneath it. <laughs> this is insane. Beautiful stuff. Oh, 
I cannot get over that fluoride plate and how red that one is. This thing was literally a vein inside that boulder. Because you can see where it grew against the granite. And obviously, uh, the acid doesn't do anything to granite. Yeah. Well, this is the boulder now. It's down to about 100, maybe 120 pounds. Hard to tell when it's still in the solution. Um, we easily, easily, easily got 100 pounds of clusters and plates and not even mention the points out of here, um, including something I, I really don't see very often, which is a fluoride vein coming out on granite. I'm not sure how that survived the acid, but it did. We got a brescia piece over here, a really, really nice uh, red, 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 red clusters that came out of one side, and you can see the difference and the amethyst veins that were running through this thing. So this one is a really, really dark red, whereas this one doesn't have nearly as much hematite over here. And I'm betting if we grab, yeah, this one's got a lot more red to it here, so you can see on the edge. So, I don't know, mixed results with this. I, I'll have to get deeper into cleaning these things to see if it was worth doing. Um, skeptical but it had to be done so hope you enjoyed it it was uh, a lot of fun to do even if it didn't turn out the best and I think there's still something to this thing when I start looking at it there's little points down in there still see some plates out on there and the, the back side of this is all one so the whole back of that is just one cluster so it'll be interesting to see